Hey everyone, my name is Tom Nuki, and welcome to my live reaction and review to One Piece chapter 931, Oh Soba Mask. Um, so, first we have the cover page, request of frogs dancing happily in a puddle, oh it's Nami, okay, in a puddle that Nami made uh, with Zeus. Um, Pen name Nota Skywalker. I feel like that sounds familiar. Uh, so that's interesting. Only 16 pages. Oh. It's uh, a little bit concerning. But <laughs> we'll, we'll take what we can get. This is exactly what I needed to disguise myself. The secret weapon that his brother gave him. Hmm? What is that you could be holding? The soap owner actually appeared. Is he stupid? He just wanted to get himself killed. But if he had waited any longer, the town would have been turned to ruins. Alright, OBS just popped up for no reason. Uh, it's still recording, so we're fine. What are you doing, Song Girl? I didn't see a problem leaving the town to to its fate. We're up against an emperor. Being stubborn doesn't always work when trying to save someone. So if I throw away my pride, then I may be able to save them. Of course, it's assuming that this thing here has the power to help. Alright, now... I think I said my, 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 my review, um, I wasn't too big of a fan, well I was in the middle, um, of Sanji using his, um, raid suit again. If he actually does use it, <laughs> Oda could just, like, pull one on us and not use it. But, uh, you never know with Oda, so let's see. Simply wearing this doesn't make me part of Jerma. <laughs> Sanji, come on. It, they're literally playing the, the German theme song in the freaking panel. So I might as well try it out. <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, hey. You shouldn't trip down in public. Oh, no. In <laughs> German. <laughs> the hell is that? Yeah, it's transforming in the... <laughs> Frankie loves it. Oh, I forgot Frankie and Sanji are now connection because they're both uh, like transformations. Let's not hide his face. Come on, Oda. I expect like a fucking helmet, but okay. Uh, that's still really cool looking. That's so cool. What is that technology? Why is he on the roof? Why is he wearing that suit? It's without. Oh, all knows. Oh, all's aware. Isn't, uh. Wait, isn't. Well, Wall's not born from the same sea where Jeremy's from, is he? I think. Wall's North Blue, right? Um, so, yeah, because Burke said he's from the North Pole, I think, back in, uh, Azo, and, uh, he knew about Jerma as well. Why do you know so much about it? Everyone from the North Pole, okay. Okay. I don't care, never call me that again. I used to read the comic strip, and I always hated Jerma. I hate him too. So they have a connection about hating Jerma. I wonder if uh, Jerma attacked. Uh, no, no, Jerma didn't attack Law's village. There's no way. Like the, I forget what this village is called, but they didn't attack it. Looks like you're not just a simple soba shop owner. Tell me your name. <laughs> I 
I'm oh so pervasive. <laughs> Sanji. Dude, orderly Kaido's gonna know it's you, first of all, because who else is a Vince Smoke and will come to Wano? It's not gonna be uh, Judge Top 5, or it's not gonna be Reiju, or it's not gonna be Niji, EG, Yonji. It's, it's, it even says on his one poster, Vince Smoke Sanji. Oh, but the hair! Oh, that's cool! I didn't even notice the hair! But the, the freaking eyebrow, uh, they could tell from that. Hey, it looks so cool. I really like it. That's so lame. Please come up with something else. Why just name you instead? <laughs> hey, Lizard, let's do this. It's time to see the power of science is capable of. What the power of science is capable of? Suits bouncing, I think. Hmm? Where'd he go? He vanished. Something hits page one in the stomach. Oh, yeah, people were seeing page one in some journal. <laughs> like, stop reaching. You guys don't want Sanji to have an actual win for once. Like, let him have a good win. Like, he's pretty much one shotting page one here. Such power. Where did he come from? He must be moving faster than our eyes can see. That's not it. It was written in the newspapers I used to read. There was a comic strip called The Warriors of the Sea. Sora. The evil army German 66 were the antagonists in it. One of their members was Stealth Black. So they had this made a long time ago. A troublesome man who was able to disappear at will. He's able to blend in perfectly with any environment and become an invis and become visible to the human eye. You know about it way too much. What's with this suit? Did it just make me invisible? So he didn't even know what? How do you give Sonic something and not tell him what it actually does? But how long is how wide am I stalking? Uh yeah, pretty wide. Alright. So the clear clear <laughs> I can't forget about the fight with him and Absalom. <laughs> so clear clear <laughs> allows you to turn invisible. There was a time when I had the dream I wanted to become an invisible man. And now, I have met the man who consumed the clear, clear fruit. You were now responsible for crushing my life. <laughs> he kind of has it now. He just looks completely different. My crushed dream has been revitalized by the germ of science that I despised. How iconic. Well, this power will surely be useful on women in the vet no no and helping my crew boy what a dilemma the cape is my shield of my heels there is an acceleration device of my souls a flotation device an invisible human oh he didn't one shot him though damn it this is weirder and weirder who are you exactly who exactly are you Show me who you really are. I mean, Sonic's body's higher than Zoro, so he's technically number two in the crew. <laughs> Not wrong. Now, it shows page one smacking him into the uh, building, but no. Sonic probably dodged into it. Wait, no, Sonic. He kicked him. He's like, oh, I'm just going to put my foot up and kick him off. Sanji, are you alright? I've expected for an ancient zone. I felt a little pain, but this shit is definitely durable. At this rate, the capital won't hold out much longer. 
Well, then all I need to do now is deliver his body to Boss Kyoshiro, of course. <gasps> oh, sorry, guys. To Boss Kyoshiro, I suppose. I never did find out his true identity. Oh, well. Hey, why are we leaving Sangiro behind? He told us to go on ahead without him. He did say that, but still. I'll ask for Nosuke and Usohachi to modify the design later. Smart. Yeah, because you can kind of see his face. And he's he just flying back, and page one notices. There will definitely send more people after us. We just keep causing problems one after another. We probably won't be able to stay in the capital. Whoa. Let's head to Ibesu Town first. Oh, okay. From back there? At the same time in Orochi's castle. Um. <sighs> Freaking Orochi. An old man in a suspicious room. The country has been isolated for centuries. They crafted the Poneglyphs. There must be one somewhere in this country. The translation, the translation's a little off. Uh, sorry, guys. Perhaps there's a hidden door somewhere around here. Looking for something? It, did she get caught? If she got caught, someone sees that she has multiple arms. She screwed. Personnel Ninja Squad of Wano Country Shogun, the Orochi Oni Wasabi. Holy shit. You're quite the troublesome ge geisha, but I'll give you one chance to explain yourself. And I mean it. Say one. Acting suspicious around ninjas would have forced in the zoo. No way, when did they? Do you not know what a ninja is? She's probably an outsider. Translators note the name of the seven gods in Japan. A tall headed god of wealthiness and happiness and longevity. I fucked that up. So that's a lot of people. Kiri Kiri Beach. I'm worried about Onichan Luffy. <laughs> He's going to be fine, Otama. Nin nin. But my master told me that nobody has ever escaped from Udon's prison. Tato. <laughs> it's so true that Raza still hasn't reported back yet. If I was stronger, I'd go save him right now. But, oh, what is that, Nin nin? It's. Oh. Well, they're dead. Yeah, Chopper's about to get low dipped again. <laughs> Chopper's about to get low dipped in uh, less than 100 chapters. <laughs> she's not a big enough. She must be a giant. But she's certainly a large human. A woman. I wonder who's bigger, her. <laughs> Chopper. Well, <laughs> that's. Uh, big mo- um. Chopper, who is? Don't say another word. You'll wake her up. <laughs> yeah, Chopper's scared as hell after what happened to the whole cake. Probably got it alive and now she's here. We need to run away right now. If she wakes up, she'll kill us. No. Won't matter. Even if we run away. If we do run away. If she's here because she's following us, then... <laughs> this woman is big mo- Go- <laughs> Be quiet. I'll kill her here and now. I'll just pretend that she's Kaido. Or the same as him anyway. Chopper Mon. You'll need to fully explain to us otherwise. I'll explain later. It's too late for us to run now. Cough. Where? At what? Wait. Who am I? Huh? 
a big surprise. So Big Mom has got, got anesthesia. Um, is that the right word? Um, I don't know how I feel about this. Because they could use this to their advantage and then use her on their side. But then again, they couldn't because she doesn't know what about her double fruit. Um, but let's go through the review. Uh, so the main thing I want to talk about, which was the main thing in this chapter, was um, his Vince Mo transformation. Like, that's godlike. Uh, stealth Black is what it's called. And the fact that Wall has noticed what it is is, is it awesome. And I love Usopp and Frankie's reactions. And the little connection that Wall and Usopp had. I hate German as well. It's not just you. And then when the lizard tries to find Sanji, you, you can't find it because he's invisible. So basically, this is a non devil fruit version of the clear clear fruit so yeah it's kind of op it's a little you like oh can't get the devil fruit i, I shouldn't say op but <laughs> it's pretty good and then they're like where did you get this power is this what happened whole cake <laughs> Well, I like the detail of, you see the number three on uh, page eight? In the center page, you see the number three, and it's like half disappeared. Neat touch. And then I love the flashback of him like, oh, the clear, clear. <laughs> and then Absalom. He's like, oh yeah, I can use the people on girls. <laughs> yeah, oh, Sanji. That's a top one. But yeah, did they finish the fight? Did they even tell us that they finished the fight? Uh, but it is confirmed that they are heading to Ibestra Town next. Uh, Frankie, Usopp, and Wall. Yeah, they did a jump cut. And then we got, we, we cut the Robin. Um, she's trying to find something. Oh, the Ponoclus. I completely missed that. So she was trying to find the Koniglus, and she was stopped by Orochi Mario's ninja squad. Which makes sense, because you're trying to find Poneglyphs. Um So yeah, she got in trouble. And, uh, I guess she should have been more careful. Like, there's not much to say about that. It was kind of a click page. This is, I think, the big thing in the chapter. Um, Big Mom... We see her <laughs> chapter's like, oh shit, it's Big Mom. But we you know if she came here and fell down like Luffy did. So she has no memory of what happened. She doesn't remember who she is. So we could use it to our advantage until she remembers. But if we take her on our side and then she remembers immediately, she can backstab us. Oda, do not go down the route of it's going to be... Luffy to me go Big Mom because Big Mom has no memories. If that happens, I swear to God, Luffy, don't. Or, or don't. Just please. I don't want that. Um, yeah, that's pretty much. I'd say this is a solid uh, 4 out of 5 chapter. I've been Purple Tom Nuki. Or I've been Tom Nuki. Uh, yeah. So I will see you guys uh, for My Hero Academia if you want to read that with me um, when it comes out. But yeah, goodbye guys.